Hi guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to read an article entitled Coinsurance for Pets. Having coinsurance for your pet means you pay a percentage of the remaining vet fees after the excess has been de deducted if you if you claim. It's worth considering if you want an affordable policy for other animals. What is a pet insurance co-payment? A co-payment, also known as cost sharing, is a an additional payment you make toward the cost of any fats, fees there as part of your claim, minus the excess. The percentage is usually 10% or 20% and your insurer will cover the rest. It can make your pet insurance premium cheaper through your contribution towards the cost of a claim increases. For example, if the vet fees are 200 euro, you might pay a 50 euro excess plus an extra 20% as a co-payment towards the cost. 20% of 150 euro to fat fifth minus excess is 30 euro so you pay 8 euro 80 euro the original excess plus the extra 30 euro and then why could I choose pet insurance with co-payments it can be an affordable way to get insurance for older pets in cats. This is usually around 10 years in a dog and in a dog's around 8 years. Although some dog breeds are classed older aged 5 plus. Some insurers increase the access for older pets, but co-payments allow you to keep your prof your previous fixed Access and pay an additional percentage towards the vet's fees instead. If you have stayed with the same insurance for years, you may find that they will start to charge a co-payment as your cat or dog reach older age. Through it, will vary between insurers. Always read the terms and conditions carefully before committing to a new policy, so you know what you are what you were expected to contribute towards the cost of a claim and then when do I have to pay a co-payment co-payment usually are usually applied after your pet reaches a certain age typically 8 for a dog and 10 for a cat if you do have make a co-payment toward fat fees it will be detailed in your policy document you have to pay the co-payment as well as the excess and it will be deducted from your policy limit. For example, if your co-payment is 20% and your excess is 100 euro, if you make a claim for ter for 300 euro of fat cost, you will have to pay the 100 euro excess plus 60 euro co-payment. The full 300 euro will be deducted from your policy limit what are the pros and cons as your pet ages and change it of it needing medical treatment increases meaning you're more likely to claim on your policy this means your premiums may increase advantage it keeps down the cost of premiums Fat treatment is more affordable. Coinsurance boosts competitions between fats, keeping price down. It can be harder to insure older pets, but coinsurance increases your option disadvantage. You pay more on top the excess. Not all providers offer pets. Insurance will with co-payment. On the other hand, you may not have a choice. You may not be a you may not be able to find many policies without a co-payment once your pet reaches a certain age. It can be hard to know how much you will have to pay as vet fees can rack up quickly. Should I consider pet insurance with a co-payment include? 
the cost of an insurance premium spread across 12 months might be an affordable way for you to get help paying for your pet's treatment, but you might find the additional copayment hard to find when you need it. So that's all the end of our article today. Bye-bye.